Oh, hey, you must be our friend. Hello. Before you jump to any conclusions, I can explain. Yeah, why don't you bring me to an area filled with in our soldiers? Yo, what's poppin' Spay? Hope you're entertained. Welcome back to Chernobyl Light. With this fine day, we'll be continuing the story of the game. In the last episode, we upgraded the base after exploring around one of the mission locations. Um, I think we were gathering a bunch of information. Um, so, let's, uh, you know, sleep. Because that's all we can right now do until the next day. And see what mission we can do. Um, so yeah, I'll be right back. Day 23. Let's see. Hello. Good morning, everybody. Oh, there's a radio you guy. Come here this instant. I'm at HQ. Oh. You better be here soon, or there will be consequences. Kozlov's going to sacrifice me. They left me here, and he is coming after me as well. We both know who I'm talking about. I can't okay. trust Kozlov anymore. You have to help me finish what we started. You and me. We're in this together until the end. Whether you like it or not, you wouldn't Shit. want him to find out the truth, would you? I'm waiting in Lenin Square. Make haste, or we're both going to regret it. I guess I really am naive, huh? Jesus. I think you owe me an explanation, old friend. Yeah, I guess you do. All right, let's see. We're definitely going to need as much ammo as we possibly can. Oh, uh, I just remember we also had to escape for our damn lives out of a military camp in the last episode, too. Um, let's grab a bunch of that ammo. Um, let's grab a couple more rounds of, uh, revolver ammo. That's what it's called. Um, where's my shotgun ammo? That's a good question. Um, there it is. Grabbing every shotgun shell that we have. Um, grabbing a fully upgraded shotgun. I think that should set up us, set us up to be decently well for this. Let's bring it on, mother of cracker. Let's go. All right. Holy shit, this day does not look great. Give me a second took a screenshot. I don't know what the NR NAR is doing, but they're doing something. Helicopters are everywhere. Spotlights are everywhere. Holy shit. Um, so yeah. Binoculars. Let's do this. Um, monster hunting and cooling towers. Anyone can do this one? Ah, Evelino can do it. Food drop. McHill, you can do that one. Exploring mission. Scash girl, you can do that one. Monster hunting Hideo. Olga, you can do that one. Food stash. Do we have one for Targa? No. Or Tarkan. Um, yeah, that looks pretty good. And for our sales, we're going to the Piet Yet Center to go help our friend. Um, go back. Let's start the mission. Go through the Rick and Morty portal. Let's go. Oh, game crashed. That's actually my first time that this game's ever crashed. That is so fucking so. Real. Those things can go through walls. I saw it with my own eyes. Hello there. Yet this one is trapped in a simple cage. That's oh, not a simple okay. cage. In most of you's proprietary NAR you don't see me? we don't know about. What the fuck? <laughs> Goodbye, buddy. I, the fuck? Why did I spawn a heel? Right next to a bunch of guys. He'll come out eventually. Everyone be ready. Yeah, I'll come out. There we go. That was a really weird spawn. I was watching a YouTube video real fast because, I don't know, loading screen. Um, and peered right in front of a guy. There's like a bunch of guys in there, I bet. Um, yeah. Yeah, there are a few. Oh, oh. Oh god, fuck! Oh god, there's actually a lot of them. Holy shit. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Jesus Christ, there's dudes everywhere! I think I trapped myself. Yep, out of that way, just keep looking. Just keep looking. Goodbye. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bug bugs bite. Yes. 
fuck's sake, his ammo is gone. Ow. Jesus Christ, got ambushed. Okay. Ray, okay. We're fine. We're fine. We just got a little bit of an ambush there. Let's collect some supplies. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. There's more of them. Oh, God. Ow, shit. Oh, no, no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I can't walk. What the fuck? Jesus Christ. Holy crap. I gotta heal. I gotta heal. Drink some alcohol after all that shit. Oh, God. Wow. I almost died like three different times there. Holy shit, dudes. A little longer than a few minutes later. <laughs> Alright, that's these four down and gone with. Man, I've been slaughtering so, so many NRA soldiers. Holy crap. Hey, mess with the wrong fella. Alright, let's check out this resource. Apparently, it was this information the doc has for us. Well, we. Some excuses. Hello, fella. Could be in heal? Is this what we need to? Nope. Why don't you normal light heal? Gee, you're a god. Oh, hey, you must be our friend. Hello. Before you jump to any conclusions, I can explain. Yeah, why don't you bring me to an area filled with NRA soldiers? Um, you know what? Let's okay. just keep playing. Start talking. Not here. Let's go someplace where we can talk privately. Everyone's <laughs> no dead. No thanks. I'm not falling for that again. Literally, You're everyone's confused, dead. You're my boy. Disturbed. The Chernobylite is messing with your head. But I can help you. And you Don't really? like that. <laughs> the way you helped me on the hospital roof. Just, God, please don't do anything rash. Okay, then. Ask your questions. Yeah. That's about the NAR. What's NAR's interest in Chernobylite? Their interest is in a potentially trillion dollar business. I trust I don't need to explain the possibilities yeah. of a nearly unlimited energy source. I don't care about that. They're keeping Tatiana here against her will, aren't they? Why? Where is she? Yeah. Tatiana is she still even so alive? A patient. A very valuable one. That's what's keeping her safe. At least for the time being. Does that wait? Does that mean that still means she's alive? Things, I give you that. They've conducted some questionable experiments on human subjects. She but Tanya is different. She's special. Um, ask about Chernobylite. I researched Chernobylite myself. It has many potential applications. What are you and your NAR overlords planning to do with it? I know you did. You wouldn't be here if you didn't. The mm. catastrophe of 1986 was a great gift for humanity. One of the greatest. What are you talking about? Chernobylite opened Dear a door God. to something that will change the history of mankind forever. They didn't say it's Chernobyl. Energy capable Within. of creating a singularity, Damn. multiple singularities, and tunnels between them. More than that, it gives us access to the ones already in existence. It's like an autonomous vehicle that can take you anywhere in time and space, complete with Damn. maps. The first such route is already in place. We just need to make sure it's safe. I already knew it could change time and space itself. To turn her. But let's find to out more about our wife. I've been you acted for. like you had no idea what happened to her. But she's been here this whole time, hasn't she? Yes. I cannot deny it. But please, you don't know all the facts. God in heaven. Is there not a single shred of decency left in you? I don't think so. I nope. can tell you things that would turn your whole life upside down. But I don't want that. I can't have you falling apart. Don't you understand? I need you. For what? What are you saying? What I need you here. Huh? You're going to help me save her. My wife? 
All right, I guess the I only option we have is sweat. Time. Where is Tatiana? Igor, please, listen to reason. You want to learn about your personal threshold for pain? I said talk. Yeah, right. bitch. Right. But it's still Koslov's fault. You have to believe me. Tanya is in the power plant, I swear it. Kozlov is keeping her there. Listen to me, Igor. This is important. You understand that what I'm trying to accomplish here is bigger than you or me. Shut your goddamn mouth. I can't listen Damn. to any more of your excuses. You can't leave him alive, Mousy. He will thwart our plan. He will bring about the end of the world and the reign of the Rat King. Don't do anything you'll regret later, Igor. You're better than them. Remember that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. More practically speaking, you might need the old bastard later. I must fail. I I'm sorry, Rat to Man. To I, I can't. But I'm leaving you alive against my better judgment. Thank you. You won't regret this, Igor. Oh, that remains to be seen. Mm -hmm. We will talk again. And when we do, I expect your full cooperation. Yeah. Absolutely. All right. Go so we're trying to talk to the man, our friend, or quote unquote friend. Quest completed. Let's go. Like men of science. Let's go. Now we can go home. Um, let's put this thing. I have 10 skill points. Jesus Christ. Man, I really sh I, I gotta, I gotta get some skill points, uh, spent. Like, dear God. I'm sorry I talk, Ken. He really does not like me. I can't, I can't please him. A lot of times he wants me to have mortal people for no reason. Let's do stunning. I think that would be a really good one. It won't affect my psyche if I do takedowns. Um, where is, I, I don't know, no. Uh, hello, my friend. Oh, there you are. Hey. Hey, What's up? Hey, what's up? Uh, we already bought any oh. particular secrets. Yes, it's the same. You know the medical data gathered after the atomic strike on Japan was classified. Whoa, nothing like a ray of sunshine to start your day. Hey, oh, God. Though, wow. It's not that surprising. This American diplomat I met once told me about it. He said the U.S. Army was shocked at how deadly the fallout was. They put more than twenty billion dollars into the Manhattan Project, after all. After their amazing yeah. victory, they couldn't admit to the public how toxic it was. Even the American troops helping the Japanese rebuild were getting sick. Yeah. So they confiscated all the medical data, Japanese and American, and classified it. That's regrettable. The biggest crime the nuclear powers have committed against their citizens was failing to admit that long-term exposure to even low levels of radiation can be more deadly than a high dose received in a short amount of time. Yeah. Yeah. That kind of secret kills people. All right. Um, let's, uh, trade. Yes. <laughs> we have already heard that before. Let's, uh, get stunning Perfect. terrain. Let's do it. Alright, I love this part of this game. I love how they do skill skills in this game. You actually get to actually practice what, uh, uh, what skill you're lording. Taking out your enemy requires mm -hmm. guts. Yep. Taking out your enemy quietly is an art. Hell yeah. You've got what it takes to do the former, but you suck mightily at the latter. Now, Damn. the lesson is about knocking out your opponent without mm -hmm. being spotted by him or anyone else. The secret lies in understanding human anatomy as well as stealth. It's about knowing how to apply enough force to put your opponent out of commission without killing them. Let's put theory into practice. Sneak up on me and perform a chokehold. Got it. Don't worry about hurting me. I'm a professional. Are you gonna let me move, game? Hello? Mm-hmm. Let's begin. Okay, I'm coming for your booty cheeks. I'm coming for these booty cheeks. Come yeah, on, give them. You give them to me. Come on. Come on. Uh, start take out. Yeah. There we go. We did it. Okay, Igor. Enough. That was impressive. Hell well yeah. Well done, soldier. Yeah, another training uh, mission. Okay, we finished that one. Uh, let's do still move and run and and, and jump more quiet. Let's do that one. Let follow. Um, so let's get ourselves a little bit of stealth training. Let's go. I'm going to share some techniques I learned in Joint Task Force Two. Hmm. During a mission, it's usually better to sneak in and out rather than gun down every opponent. I've done that for the That's most part, though. I'm going to teach you today, <laughs> stealth. Let's start with some basics. 
Try to sneak past me using available cover. Remember to stay okay. low. Keep quiet and move quickly whenever you're out in the open. Yeah. Feel like a ghost. Got it. Okay. Then let me move. Ready? Go. Okay. Sneaky, sneaky. Do we need to sneak past him or we need to, um... Still take down. Do we need to do a still take down? Or... Is that it? Well that... done, Igor. You're a natural. Oh, that's all we had to do. Easy peasy. Um... Do we have any more skills we can learn from him? Well, perfect stealth. You know what? Let's do on, that Igor? one. Let's do the next perfect stealth. Do uh, train. Some time to yes. <laughs> yes, train me. Finish my perfect. training. Let's do it. Follow. Now I'm going to teach you how to remain invisible when there's little cover. It all depends on how quick and quiet you can be. When concealed, look for the next closest cover to your goal. Oh yeah, okay. Observe the enemy, and once you see an opening, advance quickly while staying as low as you can. I'll play the role of your opponent. Alright, got it. Begin. Okay, we're gonna sneak up on him. Okay, okay, okay. Schnelth. Schnelth. So let's do this. There we go. We did it. And I think Good job, we've Igor. spent Your chances six of survival points. just increased. Wait, no. Four plus three. Seven. I think we have enough for three more. I think we got three more points. Perfect stealth has been achieved. Oh, yeah. We got three more left. Um, perfect recall. Run faster and land more safely from any heights. Assault rifles do more damage. Um, let's, let's finish, let's do perfect parkour. Shkashko, where are you? Hello? Hello, Shkashko? Hey, Igor. I'm glad you're Shkashko, is this you? So fast. Top of the morning to you, it's sir. To keep Top of the morning to you. You're in such good spirits. I like my spirits as much as any man, but I never drink before 6 p.m. It's my liver. Oh, yeah. Anyway, I'm glad you helped me with the Duca Raider. I know that at one time you were knee-deep in that shit, but I don't hold it against you. That's mighty generous of you, but... Unfortunately, I can't recall. It's buried somewhere in my memories. Huh? Yeah, well, everyone's done something they'd rather forget. Besides, there were different times. Must have been really fucked up living through the Cold War. Huh. Huh? The two superpowers with their fat fingers on yep. favorite buttons 24-7. Missile defense systems, mind control, LSD experiments. Jesus. Even detonating tactical nukes. It all happened here. Do you remember any of that? The only explosion I have a vague recollection of was the RBMK explosion. Where are you getting all this stuff from, Sashko? I met a guy when I was doing time in Budya. He knew someone who knew someone. You know how it goes. At that time, I thought it was just stupid. Tinfoil hat talk, more, too many drugs. Hmm. Only after I came to the zone did I start to realize some of it might be true. Crazy, right? I really do love Believe the way me, he Sashko, constantly that's not crazy moves. But, um, yeah, I need some training, hey, Shkash, so about I, we've already shoot. heard this before. Um, perfect parkour. Oh, Fantastic. it only takes two points. I'm ready to learn. That's gonna leave us one extra point, we're not, we're not gonna finish that this Today episode. I'll teach you more All about right. navigating obstacles and dropping to the ground without breaking oh, yeah. your hip. It'll come in handy, I promise. Bet. This is going to be something special. Just you wait, partner. Yeah? Can't wait to see you in action. Some of the rules. Enter the maze and finish, and finish it. it. Got and it. at the very end, you'll find a special treat. I don't like Just that. Be for I don't anything. like that at all. No. Go. Go make your magic proud. Oh, okay. Go. Uh, yep. Go through here. Go through here. So, uh, where do we need to go? Um, where do we go next? Hold up. Um. Don't think, partner. Jump. Okay, there we go. Okay. The of both legs to push you off the Use your whole body while moving. Yeah. 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 Imagine you're doing this for ten years. There we go. Parkour is not really a cup of tea. Huh? That was fun. Just try not to fall down any stairs, all right? This yeah. is not a man's way to die. 
If you don't overthink it, miracles can happen. Nichiro, there is more wisdom in your body than in your deepest physiology. Or Interesting. Uh, philosophy, or something. Yeah, you know something. I mean. Yeah, I get what he you means. You always land on your feet like, like a, a cat. cat. Yeah. Love him. I absolutely love him. Hey, Ego, at your oh. age, that training must have burned you way out. But you ticked all of the boxes, my man. You should be proud of yourself. Hell yeah, thank you. Well, after that train, I think I am going to end this video here. If you did enjoy the video, please consider subscribing, liking, commenting down below, and click that little link down below on my Patreon page. It's one to five dollars a month, and you get access to my content or you get exclusive content, and you also get uh, contact with me. Um, I'm gonna among other things too. But also, your name will appear here, which I want to thank you, Zoe's Mommy, for supporting the channel. And with that being said, that's really all I gotta say. So yeah, peace.